hey guys i hope you're doing well and welcome back to another video so in this one we are going to look at how we can create an overlay or a highlight material for objects here as you can see the material is overlaid on top of the original material so here you can see that we do not need to manipulate the original material of the object and what we need to do is to add an overlay on top of the object so here when you search overlay in your details tab you can see that we have this menu here and using this we are able to create a material assign it to this and create our overlay so here let me just delete the material i have made and start from scratch to show you guys how it's done so right click create a material name it m underscore overlay and open it up here i'm going to change my material to translucent so here change the blend mode to translucent and then i'm going to use my opacity emissive and base color to create my material so here hold tree and left click to add a constant tree then choose the color for example let's go with red in this case and plug it to the base color let's save and now you can see that when i assign my material it's overlaid on top of the original material in order to create the highlight effect we need to make some adjustments in the material so go back to your overlay material and here search for Fresnel it's spelled F-R-E-S-N-E-L then connect it to your opacity input and also I want to multiply these together and connect it to the emissive color so I get an emissive as well so here hold M left click plug these in and connect it to emissive color now here you can see that we have this beautiful effect and now in our level you can see that it's working in order to adjust the amount of highlights you can play with these two values here for example when i set this on one and save you can see that it looks a little different so here let me put this here and then play with these values to achieve what we want first of all let's play with this color so i'm going to make it dark and a little more reddish and then play with these values here so for example let's set this on 5 and this on 0 0.001 save and now you can see that it's looking like this so when you play the game you can see that it's completely highlighted and it's looking great all right in order to make it blink you can do a couple of cool things here so here let's add a time then add a sign i'm going with linear sign so here connect this to your exponent in here if i'm reading it right and now you have this blinking effect if you want to control how fast it blinks you can just divide your time so for example let's divide it by two and this should make it blink a little slower another thing you can do is to use this as well so you can see that when you use rounded linear sign 
the blinking will be a little different so it's up to you which one to use yeah and that's it this is how you can make a cool overlay or a highlight effect for your objects in your scene thank you guys for watching and if you enjoyed this please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel see you in the next one